Next experiment is determination of compressive strength of grain. This is the compression testing machine used to find the compressive strength of any materials like brick, tile, concrete, marble, etc. Now you can see how the compressive strength is found out for a brick. Take a brick and note its dimension. Length. Length how much? 205. 205 mm. 205 mm. Record it. Width 100 mm. Record it. 100 mm. Okay. Now keep it on the compression testing machine on the loading platform. Align the brick centrally on the base plate of the machine. This machine can be operated without electricity. It is a manually operated machine. Apply the load gradually and continuously without any shake till the brick fades. Now the load is being applied from bottom and top. Now you can see the needle is moving. Once the brick fails, the needle will stop. See the brick failed. Brick failed. Dummy needle will stay there and the main needle will come back to zero. Note down the maximum load, that is the failure load, that is 75 kilo newton. Am I right? Ah, yes, 75 kilo newton. Record it 75 kilo newton. That is the maximum load. Now we can find out the combustive strength, combustive strength of brick which is equal to maximum load divided by area that is 75 kilo newton divided by 205 that is the length 100 that is the width convert that 75 kilo newton into newton by multiplying by 1000 10 raised to 3 okay now calculate what is that value that is 75 Kilo Newton divided by the area. So calculate it. That will be the compressive strength of the brick. Calculate it. How much you are getting? 75,000 Newton divided by area. Area of the brick. That is the length and the width. Our case 205 is the length, 100 is the width. So how much it is coming? Yes. How much? Equals 3.6585. So round it to two decimals. 3.66. Make it as 3.66. Okay. 3.66 Newtons per mm square. Now compare this value with the standard values and check whether it satisfy the requirement. So this machine can be used to find out the compressive strength of any material, concrete, cement, etc. Compressive strength test of bricks procedure. One. Take the dimension of the specimen brick to the nearest 0.2 meters. 2. Place the specimen in the machine. 3. Align the specimen centrally on the base plate of the machine. 4. Rotate the movable portion gently by hand so that it touches the top surface of the specimen. 5. Apply the load gradually without shock and continuously at the rate of 14 newtons millimeter square per minute till the specimen fails. 6. Record the maximum load. After noting the dimensions of the concrete sample, keep it on the machine and start the machine. This is another type of compression strength testing machine where we can get the maximum load with the help of digital display. 
now the load is being applied from bottom and top when the concrete sample fails we can read maximum load from the digital indicator you can get the reading from this indicator now watch the sample when the load applied um, failure is starting you can see the crack is developing now the sample failed completely record the maximum load from the display it is 630 kilo newton that is the maximum load or the failure load compressive strength test of concrete procedure 1 remove the specimen from the water after specified curing time and wipe out excess water from the surface 2 take the dimension of the specimen concrete cube to the nearest 0.2 meters 3 place the specimen in the machine 4 align the specimen centrally on the base plate of the machine 5 rotate the movable portion gently by hand so that it touches the top surface of the specimen 6. Apply the load gradually without shock and continuously at the rate of 14 Newton per millimeter square per minute till the specimen fails. 7. Record the maximum load.